what is going on guys it is Heidi Z or HC Gaming coming back to you guys with uh, another vlog we are here for the pup date um Athena is not home right now she's at work I told her I would record the intro for her because she primarily does most of the vlogging for the pup dates because I do work and we want to make sure you guys have this up and ready for you on Friday um so dogs already ate dinner currently have Vi sleeping on the floor I just recorded um NFL week 8 picks just now so if you didn't check that out go ahead and check that out um we'll go ahead and link the um video down in the description below for you we got Penny sleeping right here um and currently I am working on the schedule the upload schedule for November I know you can't see it but it's on my um little tablet laptop thing um and I'm thinking about incorporating an another type of video onto um, uh, the schedule. I did talk about it in yesterday's video briefly. It's I'm thinking about doing sports news. So I wouldn't really touch on NFL unless there's something drastic that I needed to talk about. Um, and um, just checking something here real quick. Um, but it's only if there was, like, some, like, super drastic that happened, um, I would touch on football, but otherwise it'd primarily be, um, basketball, any baseball news. I know it's not baseball season anymore, at least we, we're just getting to the World Series. The first game is on tonight when I'm recording this, which is Tuesday, um, and, um, so... Basketball, hockey, baseball. What other sports? Pretty much, you know, any type of sports you guys would want me to go ahead and talk about. Um, things like that. Um, but if that's something you guys would be interested in, just go ahead and let me know down in the comment section below. But this is the pup date vlog, so I don't want to take all their time. But yeah, that's kind of the pup date on what we're doing right now, what I'm doing. And she out. Bye, girl. Bye, that K. Bye. Oh my goodness. <laughs> hi, B. Hi. 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 Oh, hello. Hello. She said hello. Um, but yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and do the schedule, and we'll see you guys in the next clip. Hey guys, this is for the pup date vlog. Just wanted to update what the pups are doing. As you saw, this little girl curled herself up in a ball while I was doing homework over there. And she was sleeping, sleeping. I didn't know that she was so asleep until I heard her snoring while I was doing my reading. Yeah. But the girls are just taking a nap right now because I'm working on homework. So there's nothing really exciting happening. So the girls are just taking a nap. Here's Pen. She was taking a nap on the floor. Yeah. They're both pretty tired. I guess. But they're both taking little naps. Pen on the floor. Vi curled up in a ball. She's awake now. But yeah. Just wanted to kind of update for the pup date vlog. What the girls are doing today, today is Wednesday, by the way. Um, it's one of the days where I don't have any classes. I'm already finished with my class. I only had one in the morning. So um, I'm just working on some homework and some club stuff. So I was finishing my homework so I can start the club stuff. And the girls were taking a nap. So I just wanted to let you guys see how cute they are and how cute they were being and what they're doing today. Hopefully they'll get more excited about what we have to do later because, well, at least she'll get excited because it involves her. Maybe Pen will be excited, but I don't know. So they're just going to finish taking a nap. I'm going to finish doing my stuff, and we'll catch you guys when we do the fun. Checking back in for the pup date. Vi's asleep again. She just actually had a little nightmare, I think. Because she started, she had just fallen asleep because I was eating chicken nuggets and she wanted some. 
but she had just fallen asleep, so she's laying here on the couch in front of me. Um, and she started kicking her legs and her back legs, and she started, like, squirreling and moving around. And then she started, like, making this, like, cry, scream noise thing coming out of her mouth that I've never heard her made bef make before. So, I woke her up. And now she's doing okay. She's back to sleep now. But, um, I think she just had, like, a mini nightmare. But, she good now. She's sleeping. She's so night-night. And Penn's over there night-night, too. But, yeah. Pretty soon, I'm going to start doing the fun stuff for her. But since she just fell asleep, I'm going to let her sleep. And then we'll go ahead and start um, doing stuff. Because I'm going to need to um, use, like, measure her and stuff when I start making stuff for her. So we'll get to that later. But she's sleep sleep right now. Hey, guys. Welcome back to the fun part of the pup date um right now it's just been the pup sleeping but um it is still wednesday by the way um we're going to well i'm going to be making vi's halloween costume so um she is going to be the toasted marshmallow part of the s'more so what we got to make her that are some cushions and they're like pillow like ones you use for like outside chairs I'm pretty sure or if you're making like cushions for chairs like those they're pillows but they're not like super thick so um and these pillowcases that are on them um they're folded because they're too big obviously for the pillows the pillows are smaller than the pillowcases so um I have to cut them and sew them to fit the pillows so that she has graham crackers. Um, I did one yesterday, so here's one of her graham crackers. Um, I haven't drawn on them yet. I am going to draw so like on the pillows so that they look like graham crackers um, with pencil first and then with one of my Sharpies that I have, but we are going to make it look more like a graham cracker. We just gotta get it on top of the pillows first before we can graham cracker it. So, this is all I've done so far, so I still need to do this one. Um, and I know that, like, it has lines and stuff in it, and I didn't iron it, but, um, <coughs> excuse me, I don't own an iron, and I'm not going to go buy one to iron pillowcases for her graham cracker costume. Plus, I'm going to use the lines that are on here. As kind of like, because graham crackers have lines in it, I'll insert a picture of a graham cracker. I'll show you my inspiration picture when I start doing that, but, um, yeah. So, I'm going to use the lines so you probably won't see them very much and it won't be very noticeable in the end. So, the next thing I have is her chocolate. Um, and this is going to go on one side of the the one of the graham crackers because she's a s'more um and you don't put chocolate on both sides of your s'more unless you're like me but um we're just gonna have chocolate on one side of her s'more because she's gonna be the marshmallow and then we'll have the other side that'll be um just the bottom graham cracker and then I got velcro and well it's not velcro my bad it's elastic and it's be i got two because i wasn't sure how much was in each and how much i was going to need but this is so that we'll wrap it around her tummy um in the front and the back to connect both um the graham cracker with the chocolate and the graham cracker without the chocolate and her in the middle so we'll use this to connect it all um 
I was thinking earlier that it's going to be kind of hard to get her into it. Um, but I think I have, if I don't, I'm going to buy Velcro to do it so we can just like, it'll be sewn to one side, but the other side will be like Velcro, like on and off. So we can just put her harness and stuff on and then we can just like put the Velcro underneath to the other side and Velcro her costume onto her. Um, I think I might have like little like buttons. Um, so we'll see with that. I think I have buttons. Um, so we could do it that way too. If I do have buttons, we'll just use those so I don't have to spend more money. Um, even though Velcro is not that expensive, but if I don't have buttons, then we have to go to the store anyway. So I'll get Velcro, but yeah, so I'm going to do her other graham cracker right now. Um, I'll go ahead and probably time lapse it, maybe, so you guys can see. And yeah, see you in a few minutes. I have to go grab my sewing kit because I forgot to get it before I sat down, even though I told myself to. <laughs> Let me show you baby bye right now. She's chilling on her graham cracker. So I have you on the table. Um I don't know what that is. I finished her second graham cracker. Um here it is. This one came out a lot better than the first one I did. Um, I think I'm going to go around the sides and cut them with these. Um, so that the sides stop fraying because if I'm looking right here, I can see some of them are fraying. So I might go back with this on both of the pillows if Baby Vile went off the other graham cracker. Um, the sewing job that I did isn't the best. Um, but I don't really care, um, because it's not that serious. Um, you're not really gonna pay attention to it. You're not gonna see it. It's not that bad. It's not that serious. And ideally, if I was doing it, like, if she was in, like, some type of costume contest or something, I would use a sewing machine, obviously, to do this, because it's a straight line. Um, but... I don't have my sewing machine with me. It's at my mom's house. So, um, all I got is my sewing kit, which is just my needles and thread. So I can do stuff by hand, but I can't do stuff with like a sewing machine. So ideally this would have been done with a sewing machine to make it like a lot cleaner and nicer and like yeah, but it doesn't really matter. It's also a graham cracker. And graham crackers do not always come out of the package looking pretty. So, it's okay. So, I'm going to cut these, the edges with those scissors I showed you. And then I'm going to figure out how to do her chocolate. And I'll get back to you. So, I just looked up, babe, I still sleep by the way. I just looked up on my phone some inspo pictures on s'mores. I definitely did not cut the sides like I said I was going to. I'll do that in a second. But um, I looked up some pictures of s'mores because I know her chocolate only goes on one side of only on one of her graham crackers because she's the marshmallow. I could put chocolate on both sides of the graham crackers, but traditionally, when you see s'mores, it's only on one side of the graham cracker. And I'm looking at all these pictures of s'mores, and a lot of them, even like the cartoon version s'mores, have 
the chocolate on the bottom of the s'more and a lot of them have the chocolate on um like a lot of them have the chocolate on the top of the s'more too like it's like graham cracker chocolate marshmallow graham cracker or graham cracker marshmallow chocolate graham cracker like a lot of them have both so I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna put her chocolate on one side and then it'll be her in the middle and then the other graham cracker and yeah I think that's what I'm gonna do because um, that's what a lot of the pictures showing I'm trying to find a picture of like a s'more like sideways so I can know what side it's gonna be on because it's she's obviously gonna be in the middle of it so it's gonna be sideways a sideways s'more but um yeah I think I'm gonna do her chocolate so it's gonna be like if she's like standing like right here and her face is right here I think it's gonna be like graham cracker chocolate her graham cracker because I think that makes sense and she's laying on that side right now so I'm guessing that could be her bottom side so I think that's how we're going to do the chocolate um, if Heidi gets home and doesn't like it, we can just flip it. It does, it's not that serious. Um, but yeah, so I'm now going to actually cut the sides like I said I was going to do a while ago. Um, and then do her chocolate. I think I'm going to fold it a couple of times so it makes like a thick chocolate, but also make sure maybe I'll sew it down the middle. Um, cause you usually put two squares of chocolate, so make it look like there's two little squares with this fabric, but you'll see how I do that in the next clip. Hey guys, so I've moved locations to the couch because my back was hurting um, from sitting on the floor. But I sewed, like, can't really see it, can you? Yeah, I sewed like the under portion because it's folded a couple of times to make it thick. And I thought if, if I moved with me, her other graham crackers over there, but I thought that if... Um, I sewed it all at once that it'd be too thick and it like would be hard to go through. So I did the two sides and now I'm going to do the end and then see if I have to go over the sides again now that they're folded back over. Um, but we'll see. So I just wanted to update you on why the location is different and the first part of the chocolate on her graham cracker. Now I'm moving on to part two. guys so I finished her chocolate so she has chocolate attached to her graham cracker now one of her graham crackers um yeah so now she has some chocolate on her graham crackers she's right here with me she's asleep um so I've finished both of her graham crackers and put the chocolate on her graham cracker um the only thing left to do is to draw on the, like, make, draw to make the pillows look more like graham crackers and connect it all together with the elastic. Um, but I've decided I am going to do Velcro, so, um, I'm probably going to work on that part of it. I'll probably have Heidi help me measure how much elastic to put, like, how much around her, um, belly. 
um, it is, and then we'll cut it, and then I'll probably on Friday, um, go ahead and, um, attach both the graham crackers and everything all together and finish up her costume in full, but all the parts of her costume are done. We just have to connect it now. So, um, yeah, um, she sleep. That's probably going to be it for the pup date today, but I'll probably have more stuff tomorrow. Um, this vlog is going up on Friday, so if I do finish this on Friday, you will still get the vlog on Friday. Um, I'll just probably do it in the morning. I don't have any classes on Friday, so that shouldn't be that hard. But, yep, that's it for today. So, I'm going to take a break now because my hand's hurting because I have to do it all by hand. And... Uh, my back was hurting from sitting on the floor. So, see you guys in the next clip. Look how cute the s'more is! <laughs> uh, it's now Friday. I finally finished her costume. She's now a s'more. And look how cute she is. <laughs> She's so cute. Okay, I'm going to take it off of her so, it doesn't, so she doesn't ruin it. And then I'll tell you guys you how I finished to eat it. Your heart? Hey guys, it's Friday. Um, so you just saw Vi's costume. Um, I just wanted to catch it really quick because she was really excited. Um, and I didn't want her to mess it up before Halloween. And I wanted to get it off of her before um, she started going crazy and messing it up. Because I just spent like four days making it. Um, but yeah, she looks really cute. I think it worked out. Um, she has her graham cracker and her chocolate because she is the toasted marshmallow in the middle. Um, we, I tried to do the elastic to attach it, but the elastic like wasn't sturdy enough because it like has so much stretch to it that the pillows, the pillows, like her graham crackers were just like falling, like open when we put it on her. So, um, her harness actually like one part like a that comes out and it goes back in to like make another leg hole but it comes like you can take it apart so I took it apart and slid her graham crackers on the sides of her harness on the sides of her harness like her head goes here and the leg hole and the leg hole so I slid it on this inside part um, and that worked a lot better because it's a lot sturdier, but there was still a problem of the pillows like sliding down and falling and it's because like nothing was holding them up. So that's why there's elastic Velcro to the top and that's just to hold the pillows together so they stop like falling out. Um, so yeah, um, we were going to put it on the inside, but then I felt like they would still fall out and we needed like the pillows to be brought together at the top because that was our problem. Um, so yeah, I was very frustrated because that was the last piece and that's like the whole thing to put it together and it wasn't working how I thought it would. But um, we finally got it to work. As you saw, she's super cute as a little s'more. Um, she's very excited about it because she's been watching me make it. Um, so this is going to be the end of the pup date vlog. Um, I'll make sure to insert the videos when I was making it. I didn't take any videos doing the last part, like connecting it to our harness and like doing the Velcro. Just because it was frustrating me a lot because I couldn't figure out how to do it. And I kept having to like redo it different ways. So I didn't make any videos about that. But how you like your costume by? You like it? Are you excited to be a s'more? Yeah. Okay. So, we'll see you guys in the Sunday vlog. If you want to see all of us dressed up, make sure to follow the social medias. We'll definitely be um, posting pictures on Halloween. Yeah. Do you want to say anything? No? Yes or no? Okay, make sure you guys uh, like and subscribe and do all that fun stuff that Heidi usually says. And yeah, um, I hope you guys have a good weekend and we'll see you in the Sunday vlog.